हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू सी द टॉपिक व्हाई डू वी फॉल इल वी विल हैव फोर सेशंस टू कवर दिस टॉपिक इन फर्स्ट सेशन विल कवर द हेल्थ एंड डिजीजेस इन सेकंड सेशन वी विल सी टाइप्स ऑफ डिजीजेस एंड कॉजेस ऑफ डिजीजेस इन थर्ड सेशन वी विल सी मोड्स ऑफ ट्रांसमिशन एंड इन फोर्थ सेशन वी विल सी द प्रिवेंशन और ट्रीटमेंट ऑफ डिजीज नाउ इन फर्स्ट सेशन वी विल कवर हेल्थ एंड डिजीजेस so now we need to first know what is health health means state of being physically mentally and socially fit physically fit means you are able to perform all your activities normally or properly that means your body functions in a proper way mentally fit means you are able to understand what all things are essential for you to live a healthy life okay and social fit socially fit means uh, you have a clean you live in a clean surrounding uh, you have good sanitation and all so okay first so for being healthy or you can say to have a good health you should be physically mentally and socially fit now there are some of the conditions which are essential for good health like the person should be physically fit and fine he should have good social and economic conditions like uh, means the person should have good social equality and harmony when he lives in a community should have a clean environment because unclean environment or if your surrounding is dirty or polluted it gives you a mental fitness unfitness also okay so this was about health now what is the difference between health and disease free means what is a good health or disease free so health means it's regarding all physical and social environment as well as your mental fitness okay and disease free means it just an absence of disease in a body okay so disease free refers to only an individual okay but health means it covers all physical social as well as your mental environment okay and disease free means you are only not having the disease but you can that means an individual may have good health or may have poor health understood so now what is exactly disease disease means disturbed ease disease means disturbed ease means you are not able to perform your work comfortably okay many times uh, when you say disease uh, you can find a specific or particular cause of discomfort means you are not able to perform or work comfortably you are uncomfortable in doing the daily life activities or uh, there are some changes in the appearance in the system of the body so that leads to an abnormal functioning so abnormal functioning of the body is called as disease okay now this diseases give rise to various symptoms and signs symptom means these are the experiences that are feel that are felt by patient okay that are felt by patient like uh, he is feeling uh, you know you can say a headache he is not able to breathe properly so these are the symptoms which are experienced by patient and signs are you can say the observations done by doctor in patient so patient experience symptoms doctor observe signs and then he can detect or he can recognize the disease which the patient is suffering from so like this we can see say that the disease uh, are caused due to uh various uh, you can say abnormal functioning of the body there are various symptoms you can say like uh, here you can say shortness of breath you are not able to breathe properly okay which which leads to lack of energy also many times you can find swelling on the leg you have a uh, abnormal you can say uh, sleeping habits you know and you are not able to breathe properly at night okay so 
next you have loss of appetite means uh, you have indigestion many times you know when you are observing such type of symptoms or you can say if you are uh, acquired by any disease your digestive system also plays a major role in that what happens your uh, digest your food is not digested properly okay again you find coughing you have frequent urination or uh, you are uh, not able to remember things properly which gave rise to the impaired memory so all these are nothing but the symptoms of disease okay so this was all about health and disease in next session we are going to cover about the types and causes of diseases